All right, everyone. Hello. Welcome to another episode to a new Let's Play. Actually, as we're gonna start off with a game I've been really looking forward to, Fire Emblem Three Houses. Let's go. You excited? I'm excited. Can't. Ah, oh, they use the old school theme. It's so nice. Okay, so I did run a little recording test to see how everything turns out, so I think I found something I like. So I'm gonna start a new game. And we're going on hard. Oh shh. You know, I for the for the recording test I did casual. I didn't go very far, it even didn't even really come into effect, so you know what? We're hardcore fire, emblem fire emblemers, right? And if people die, I just restart anyway. I just save scum, so... Doesn't make a difference! Connect to the online network so we can compare ourselves and our e -peens. And I love this loading screen, by the way. I love the little sprite. The 8-bit sprite. Okay. Come see, shut up. Do you recall the Red Canyon? You'll die! <laughs> die! Die! You took everything that I loved! Mega yikes. Oh no, it's a lolly girl. The thousand year old lolly girl. Brought you here. Wait, 
where am I exactly? Uh, oh, I wonder how you got in here. It is most rude to interrupt a moment of repose. Oh, very rude indeed. Sorry. I wish to have a look at you. Okay. I guess I gotta do what she says. I'm obviously a female. This is my true form. I may sound like a man, hmm, but inside I, I am a female. The likes of you before. Who are you anyway? I am a great demon. Do not deceive. Uh -oh. You would do well to keep your wit in line. Hmm. She didn't buy it. Then I'm a ghost. Do not Ooh. deceive. Uh -oh. You would do well to keep your wit in line. I am a human. A then you must have a name of sorts. Go on. Why, yes. My name. Oops. No, no. It's not Kareth. I'm not Byleth. I am. Get waste. Get. Wait. I'm gonna run the letters, alright? God damn it. Apparently, everyone in the land of. In this land only has maximum eight letter names. So we're gonna go with Trogdor. The, the most common female name of this land. Huh. I shall not ever grow accustomed to the sound of human names. What's your name, huh? You Three question marks. Of birth as well. Beneath which moon and on what day were you born to this world? Ooh. Well, I'm not gonna put my real birthday, so I'm gonna put on the I'm gonna put on the day I wish I was born, which is, uh... <laughs> well, wonders never cease. It seems we share our day of birth. How strange. Oh, that's why your hair is green, then. Mm. And your eyes. It all feels so... familiar. I think it may be time for... Get another nap. <sighs> Girl, I'm in your house, and you're just gonna take a nap? You don't even know who I am. You just met me. I'm also loving how everything is voice acted right now. It's actually really, it's a nice change. I think this, is this the first Fire Emblem game to be fully voice acted? Like, that is amazing. I think like the only other final game I was thinking about having like Hey, time to wake up. Shut up. Wait, is his you name say dream again? Gerald? Gerald of Riviera? I was dreaming about a young girl. I'm coming out to you, father. You described her to me before. I don't think I've ever met anyone like that. In any case, just put that out of your mind for now. The battlefield is no place for idle thoughts. Risking your life is part of the job for mercenaries. He's like shutting us. down my hetero, my monitor, homosexuality. Sure way to get yourself killed. It's 2019, Gerald. Come on. Okay, time to get moving. Our next job is in the kingdom. I told you before, it's far from here, so we'll need to leave at dawn. All right. Hmm? Oh, good grief! Everyone is already waiting for us outside. <laughs> Didn't like that Gerald, response. Sir, sorry to barge in, but your presence is needed. What's happened? Yeah, like the Please first, like. Oh. We wouldn't bother you with it's the characters on the cover. What do a bunch of kids like you want at this hour? We're being pursued by a group of bandits. I can only hope that you will be so kind as to lend your support. Bandits? Here? It's true. They attacked us while we were at rest in our camp. We've been separated from our companions and we're outnumbered. They're after our lives. Not to mention our gold. I'm impressed you're staying so calm considering the situation. I... Wait. That uniform. Bandit spotted just outside the village. Damn. There were a lot of them. I guess they followed you all the way here. We can't abandon this village now. Come on. Let's move. Hope you're ready. Duh. Yeah, I was gonna say, like, I remember there was, like, a big deal when, like, the first 
All right, that's my testing. So I'm just going to go to file three, file five. I remember like when the Path of Radiance like cinematics were fully voiced, everyone was like losing their shit because that was like the first time they like fully voiced something. It was only cinematics, but it was still it's awesome. But now here we are, just fully voiced, just random dialogue lines. Also, here comes the tutorial stage. A skirmish at dawn. Look at all these banditos. Let's take care of those thieves before they overrun the village. Take down the enemies in front first. That should take the wind out of their sails. Yes, tutorial man. Select the unit and move next to an enemy. When you're well, your unit is next to an enemy, the command window will open. To attack, select the attack command and choose a weapon. So, uh, spoiler alert for the people who care about which road I'm choosing. I'm gonna go with the Black Eagles. I'm choosing the Edelgard route, because... She's a grill. I will so I'm gonna try and feed her a bit. Stay focused. Alright, by left. I mean truck door. Let's attack. 93%. Let's go. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. He's a thief. A thief with a sword. Weapon will break when repeated use brings its durability to zero. You can fight with a broken weapon, but your might and hit rate. Be reduced. Enemies will make follow-up attacks more easily. Be careful; your weapons cannot repair them mid-battle. Okay. Those can attack from long range, although the hit rate is reduced as range increases. They are highly effective against flyers like Pegasus Knights and Wyvern Riders. Wyvern Riders. Ready and willing. Wyvern. I'm pretty sure it's Wyvern. All right, let's it's talk. Because of you guys, that I'm not dead right now. Thanks for that. You're welcome. I didn't expect to run into mercenaries like you in some remote village. The gods of fortune must be smiling on me. Okay, you said mercenaries. But where are the rest of my mercenaries, man? It's just like me and my dad right now. Even the, even the guy delivers the message was like not even here anymore. Thank you. We are in your debt. You wouldn't do for us to fall in a place like this. Please, lend us your strength. Let's work together to drive out these thieves. Sure. Alright, Edelgard. 76. That's a pretty good percentage. Yes. My bad luck is not affecting me yet. Okay, we use battle menu to create bookmark saves. Or bookmark saves. The tutorial guides. Oh, bookmark like mid battle saves. Okay. The tutorial guides and more. To access, press the push the A button to crown it without a space to activate it. Enemy face and player face and back over again. Yep. Is my dad not going to help me fight? We'll advance while protecting ourselves from the enemy. Take up position inside the forest. Certain terrain effects will have will have effects on the unit occupying it. Forests, for instance, raise units evasion and defense. Move your units to advantageous terrain and prepare to meet the enemy. So, like the last game I played was like Fire Emblem Fates, conquest, by the way, not Birthright. Yes. And uh, forest, we can sustain their attacks without losing it's so advantage. good to have weapon durability back. Okay, different kinds of healing tiles, I mean, terrain tiles, so be sure to be mindful, is what it's saying. Let's talk. You have a strange aura about you. You say you're a mercenary, so show me what you can do. do, 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 do. I mean, it's pretty hype. All right, let's go. Opportunity. Use the combat arts I taught you. All right. Anyway, combat arts. Combat arts are powerful techniques that are used more weapon durability than usual. They do not typically allow for follow-up attacks. 
Yields learn new combat arcs when their weapon skills level go up. There are no combat arts for reason or faith. Those skills grant magic instead. I don't know what reason or faith is. So combat arts, they don't typically left for follow up. So what I'm hearing there is don't use it if you're a fast unit. So yeah. Okay. Can I combat art you? Tempest Lance. I lose five weapon durability. Wow. But I would one shot you. Let's do it. Ooh. Over already. So is hard mode gonna be like a, a case where like I'm gonna have to like combat arts everyone? <laughs> oh wait, let's check your combat arts. Curve shot. Increase my hit and attack. I lose three durability, and my range goes from two to three. Okay. I don't know what these other numbers are. C PRT, RSL. I don't know what those mean. But. Uh, Ooh, let's attack this dude. Good job. Dude, these combat arts are... I guess they're... OP. Just gotta buy a lot of cheap weapons to just keep it on them. Let's see, what are, your, what are your combat arts? Wrath Strike. Increase hit, increase attack by 5? Holy moly. Increase hit by 10. Iron Sword. Alright. They seem to have that, like, kind of spirally dust thing around them when they do it. Alright, build up that. What are your combat arts? Smash. You get 3 damage and 20 hit. And 20 crit. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. But you lose the most durability with 5. Just smash? Just recklessly smashing makes you like increase your hit rate. <laughs> Witness my power. Okay, so I don't want to use it. I only use it when I have to. Select item option to change your equipped weapon or use items such as vulnerabilities. Which... Yeah. Damn! Why are there mercenaries in the village? Guess we'll have to deal with them too. How many merc? Wait, how many mercenaries were there? There's been like we killed like five so far. So there's like eight total? It's not that many. Oh, my dad's finally decided to help. Come on, Gerald of Riviera. Okay, green stuff means they drop things. What are you dropping? The Ion Axe. Okay. Let's put you in the bushes. And... Alright, let's go. I'm gonna kill you. Kill you, where you oh, I don't have to read them anymore. Oh my god, I'm like used to that. Oh, that was a, that was a big hit. Uh, what? How's he attacking me right now? Level 2! Yeah! That was a what shitty level up. What is what is CHA? Charisma? Like what is that? Okay. Nice hit. Now my face. No, don't kill him. Don't kill him. No. Face XP I could have had. Fuck. Back to it. Damn it, Dad. Ruin everything. And then he runs away. Attack when an ally is nearby, and the enemy will be intimidated, making them easier to hit. Intimidated? Really? Oh no, he has friends. When you attack an enemy that is also in attack range, one or more of the other units, you will trigger a linked attack. During linked attack, your avoid and hit rate are higher than normal. Some linked attacks also raise might, aka damage. Good use of linked attacks is key. Also build support. Okay. Think this through. Ooh. Ooh, that's risky. But it's only 48 
What if I combat arts it? Smash. Oh. Hey, that's pretty good rate. I can't miss a 97, right? <laughs> not today. Whoa, she just leveled up again? Insane. Strength X res. Alright. And she got an iron axe. Oh no, I missed XP on the other guy. <gasps> Playing so inefficiently. What? I was the one that was gonna die, though. After all, if you don't know the value of your own life, you're not going to protect it very well, are you? Of course not. <laughs> well then, I guess it's up to me to guide you from now on, right? You can call me Sothis, but I'm also known as the Beginning. Is there another lolly girl that's called the End? Hmm. Sothis, though. Sothis. Yes, that is it. My name is Sothis. And I am also called the Beginning. But who once called me that? Sothis? I was not I able talk to with my hands. My name until just now. And just like that, it came to me. How odd. That look upon your face. Did you think me a child? A mere child who forgot her own name? Yes. Fooey! That child Fooey. saved your life. And what does that make me? I'm less than a child? <laughs> Correct. You understand. You threw yourself before an axe to save just one young girl. But she's Yet best girl. as well, as I have stalled the flow of time for now. You would have died had I not intervened. Thank you. There now. Is gratitude so much to ask? I did deem you worth saving after all. Though it is only momentary, time has stopped. However did I manage that? What now? When time begins again, the axe will tear into your flesh, and you will surely meet your end. Mm. <sighs> How rude of you to drag me into this. Now what to do? Uh, keep time frozen until I'm safe. <laughs> that is ridiculous. Oh, but perhaps... Of course. I must turn back the hand They don't even let me go through all the other options. They're like, just choose the right one. Yes, I do believe it can be done. You really are quite troublesome. I cannot wind back time too far, but all is well. You are aware of what's to come, which means you can protect yourself this time. Now go! Yes, you who bears the flames within. Drift through the flow of time to find the answers that you seek. I had a lot of time just to stand there hey, and here. watch him attack me. Even in the first thing, I could just p push her and then probably take in a stance. Hey, did you just turn back time? Yes. The Knights of Seros are here. We'll cut you down for terrorizing our students. Hey. 
The thieves are running away. Go after them. Knights of Saros. The students seem to be unharmed. And who's this? Uh, why him? Oh, you know each other? Stage complete. Ten five turns. And Edelgard, Edge Lord, is MVP. Good job. Good job, team. Thank you. Most deployed. Huh. All those names that we haven't Conjured. met yet. It is you. Goodness, it's been ages. Alois? Is that his name? Me? It's Alois. Oh. Right -hand man. Sounds French. Well, that's how I always thought of myself anyway. Oh, it must have been 20 years ago that you went missing without a trace. I always knew you were still alive. You haven't changed a bit, Alois, just as loud as ever. And drop that captain nonsense. I'm not your captain anymore. Dancho. These days I'm just a wandering mercenary. One who has work to do. Uh, goodbye, old friend. Right. Goodbye, Captain. Wait. Dancho. That isn't how this ends. I insist that you return to the monastery with me. Garrig Mock Monastery. Uh, I suppose this was inevitable. And how about you, kid? Are you the captain's child? Uh, I'm a bandit. <laughs> oh, he liked that Quite one. Sense of humor, this one. Clearly cut from the same cloth as the captain. I'd love for you to see the monastery too. You will join me, won't you? Yes. <laughs> What's troubling you, Captain? You aren't about to run off again, are you? Even again. I wouldn't dare run from the Knights of Saros. Knights of Saros? They do seem rather skilled. Uh, ah, is she just talking my head now? Is required. Get going. Great. Great, she's talking my head. I appreciate your help back there. Your skill is beyond question. You're clearly an experienced mercenary. And your father, that would be Gerald, the blade breaker? Former captain of the Knights of Saros, oft praised as the strongest knight to ever live. Have I missed anything? I didn't even know that. I didn't know he was a captain. How curious. I'd wager the explanation for that is fascinating indeed. Hey, you are coming with us to the monastery, right? <laughs> of course you are. I'd love to bend your ear as we travel. Well, Don't the game's gonna make me come, so... The students of the Officers Academy at Garrick Mock Monastery. We were doing some training exercises when those bandits attacked. I definitely got the worst of it. That would be because you ran off. Too true. I was the first to make a strategic retreat. <laughs> everything would have worked out if these two hadn't followed me and ruined everything. Because of them, every single one of those bandits chased after us. Utterly ridiculous. Ah, so that's what you were thinking, Claude. And here I thought you were acting as a decoy for the sake of us all. His intentions were as clear as day. You will prove a lacking ruler if you cannot see the truth behind a person's words. <laughs> you will prove a lacking ruler yourself if you look for deceit behind every word and fail to trust those whom you rely on. Oh, joy. Ooh, some a strife. royal debate between their highnesses. I wonder how being completely predictable affects one's ability to wield power. Personally, as the embodiment of distrust, I'd say your little exchange smacks of naivete. <laughs> I have a day. Tell me, are you actually incapable of keeping quiet, or is your lack of self-awareness a condition? People, of some sort? people. Oh my God. In any case, forgive our digression. Everyone's so savage. I will speak with you if you can spare a moment. The way you held your ground against the bandit's leader was captivating. You never lost control of the situation. It showed me I still have much to learn. Your skill is. You missed the part where I almost got killed by him, and I stopped time and reversed it, though. Services to the Empire. I might as well tell you now. I am no mere student. I am also the Adrestian Empire's. Halt, Edelgard. Please allow me to finish my own proposition. The Holy Kingdom of Fargus is in dire need of exceptional individuals like yourself. Please, 
Do consider returning to the kingdom with me. Whoa, there. You two sure are hasty. Trying to recruit someone you just met. <laughs> Tactless, really. I was personally planning to develop a deep and lasting friendship on our journey back to the monastery before begging for favors. But it seems there's no time for niceties in this world. So, capable stranger, let's get right to it. Where does your allegiance lie? Hmm. It seems one's place of birth is quite significant to them. Yet they are so impressed by you that you may take your pick. Well... Edelgard. <laughs> a wise choice. Though the Empire has fallen from its former glory, the other regions are merely offshoots that pale in comparison. All right, that's enough with Jeez, she just insults the it's other two. To head back to the monastery. Looks like we'll have to pick this up another time. My, my, they are in such a hurry. You know, each of the three is most unique. Edelgard. She's always evaluating me. Yeah. Dimitri. Look at those golden locks of hair. But I sense darkness. How the hell did you sense that? Claude. Look at that braid on his right side. Or his right, you know. Yes, I felt the same. Oh, I am so sleepy when she's here. Oh, I may be sleeping, but... But you what? File four. Look at it dancing. Oh, my switch is too fast. White clouds, great tree moon. White cloud. Oh, it reads it for me. Wow. Great tree moon. Three houses. Okay, thanks, Gerald. Of Riviera. The icy winds of the Agma Mountains have begun to scatter. And the verdant fields once again spring to life across Vodlin, heralding the start of a new year. As they celebrate the dawning year, the people pray that they may realize their full potential, just as a tiny sprout hopes to one day grow into a great tree. Interesting uh, painting. I don't quite get it. The continent of Vodlin, said to be protected by a revered goddess, has existed since time immemorial. Three ruling powers now control the land. Where's Tellius? In the south lies a region long held by a more than 1,000 year old dynasty, the Adrestian Empire. Beyond its borders, to the frigid north, is the home of the Holy Kingdom of Vargas, ruled by the royal family and its knights. To the east, a league of nobles that heeds no king nor emperor rules what is called the Leicester Alliance. Once consumed by a tempest of war and turmoil, Fodlin and these three mighty powers now exist in relative harmony. Is that really how you say Leicester? I would have said Leicester or Leicester. This will be your first time at the monastery. I'd be happy to show you around. It really is Fodlin in a nutshell. The good and the bad. Like it or not, we'll be there soon enough. Man, they need to make a final anime. There it is. Garrick Mock Monastery. Teacher wearing seductive clothing. Look how high those, that dress goes up her leg. Come on, man. Ray is here. 
Who's Rhea? Is that her? Is that the girl from the first trailer we saw? Not I first wonder, trailer, but first cinematic. Did the flow of time bring you here? It's been years since I've last set eyes on this place. I'd be forced to see her now. Uh... Forced? I feel like you could have said no. I've never spoken of this to you before, but many years ago, I was a knight here. I reported to the Archbishop, Lady Rhea. As you know, the majority of folks in Fodlan are devout followers of the teachings of Seros. The leader I, I of a ridiculously that. large religious organization is the Archbishop, Lady Rhea. Thank you for your patience, sir. My name is Setic. I am an advisor to the Archbishop. Right. Hello. It has been a long time, Jill. I wonder, was it the will of the Goddess that we have another chance meeting like this? Forgive my silence all these years. Much has happened since we last spoke. So I see. The miracle of fatherhood has blessed you. That is your child, is it not? Yes. Born many years after I left this place, I wish I could introduce you to the mother of my child, but I'm afraid we lost her to illness. I see. My condolences. As for you, I heard of your valiant efforts from Alois. What is your name? What? My name is... A fine name indeed. Trador. From the bottom of my heart, I thank you for saving those students of the Alliance. I should name myself Alliance. something trolly like Poopy Butt or something. Gerald, you already know what it is I wish to say, do you not? You want me to rejoin the Knights of Seros, don't you? I won't say no, but... Your apprehension stings. I had expected that Alois would have already asked this of you. I must step away for now, but I expect they will desire a word with you soon. Please listen carefully to what they have to say. Until tomorrow, farewell. Okay. Uh, I can't believe it. Force back into the Knights of Seros. I'm sorry I dragged you into this. Looks like I'll be stuck here for a while. And I'm afraid your services are requested as well. I'm be working here? I've never had a job before. I only worked at, like, Chuck E. Cheese's at one time. As a servant? Nothing like that. They want you to teach, by the sound of it. You heard those teach. brats earlier talking about the Officers Academy, right? Well, the Academy just happens to be short a professor. And apparently, that damned Alois went and recommended you to Lady Rhea. So, you must be the new professor. My, how stern and handsome you are. Uh, no. Oh, she's <laughs> flirty. I'm not the one you're looking for. You can handle things from here. Good luck. And, watch out for Lady Rhea. I don't know what she's thinking, making you a professor like this. She may be up to something. Stay on your guard. Hmm. Oh, it's you then? So young. Competence and age are not necessarily correlated, as you well know. I am Hanneman, a Crest Scholar and Professor at the Officer's Academy. Crest I Scholar? I wonder if you bear a crest of your own. When next you have a moment to spare, I insist that you pay me a visit so we can delve into the subject further. I'm Manuela. I'm a professor, a physician, a songstress, and available. It's nice to meet you. Did she just hit on me? <laughs> I look too pretty for that line of work, do I? But yes, when I'm not teaching, I can be found in the infirmary. If you're ever lonely, please do come and pay me a visit. I would love to. Spare our colleague the needless chatter, Manuel. Now then, it seems you'll be taking charge of one of the Academy's three houses. 
I expect you haven't yet been briefed on the nature of each, have you? Do you really not know? Fine. I'll do you a favor and explain. The Officer's Academy is comprised of three houses of students, each of which is closely affiliated with its region of origin. The Black Eagle House is for students from the Adrestian Empire. Their house leader this year is Edelgard, the Imperial Princess, who is in line to be the next Emperor. The Blue Lion House is for students from the Holy Kingdom of Pardus. Their house leader this year is Prince Dimitri. He is to be the next King of Pardus. Lastly, there is the Golden Deer House, which is for students of the Leicester Alliance. Their house leader is Claude, grandson to Duke Regan, the leader of the Alliance. To think that the next Emperor, King, and Sovereign Duke are all here. It certainly is a promising year for the Academy. I'll say. I just hope none of those little treasures cause any trouble. Hmm, quite. For now, I suggest taking a stroll around the Academy to get your bearings. And when you've a moment, please stop by my research laboratory. The old man has a point. Oh, and keep in mind that I've only notified the house leaders that you're our new professor. It's more fun that way. I suggest you try spending time with the students. Some odd ducks in that bunch, but they're good kids. I'm sure Lady Rhea will have more information for you tomorrow, but that should get you going. Good luck. You'll need it. Uh... Have you no intention of changing your mind, Rhea? Appointing a stranger, a child no less, as a professor at our esteemed academy is... I have made my decision, Sedith. I know worrying comes naturally to you, but there is truly no need. That stranger is Geralt's flesh and blood, after all. And Geralt left I can't you. say that's all too comforting. How trustworthy is this Geralt character? Is he not the man who went missing after the Great Fire 21 years ago? 21? I would remind you that Flane is now here with us as well. I beg of you, please consider whether this is an unnecessary risk. That means Byleth is 21 years or younger. They have my trust. Let that be enough Which probably means I'm well. like 16. More importantly, I have received a report from Shamir. I am increasingly concerned about a matter regarding our suspicious individual. We cannot ignore those who harbor ill will toward the church, especially if they are frequenting Garrick Mach. Yes, that matter is of great importance as well. I shall continue my investigation. Rhea, for now I will have faith that you are placing your trust with the utmost care. I pray that nothing occurs to shake that confidence. Except your confidence is already shook. That's why you had that conversation, idiot. Got him. I love how they made the little sprites dance. Look at them dance. Look at her run. Fall, chase the line up. Oh. You can't reach it, just dance. The bell mimicked the fire emblem theme, so cool. All the members of the three houses. God, look at the haircuts. Huh? Reiner? Armor Titan? Is that you? Oh. Is she a magician? That guy is creepy. she doing? She's a shy one. Oh. Whoa, 
don't you look spectacular? Damn, look at those hips. Okay, while exploring, do that, do that. Look left if you ever don't know what to do. Okay.